Hey, Karina here, coach and mentor for highly sensitive people and creative programs, Synchronize Your Life. Today, I'm going to talk about why maybe you feel depressed if you're a high sensation seeking, highly sensitive person. First of all, the main piece that I want you to take with you is the difference between seeking happiness and seeking meaning. If you're depressed, maybe you are judging where you are at in life right now and you're judging yourself for not being happy or you're judging yourself for not being where you think you should be, rather than seeing the meaning in where you are right now, seeing the meaning of the lessons that you came here to learn and the challenges that you came here to face. The main thing I want you to focus here and ask yourself is, am I seeking for happiness or am I seeking for meaning? The second reason why you might be feeling depressed is because you're comparing yourself to others. You're seeing, maybe on social media, how great other people's lives are, maybe the highlights of their life. And for you, you're looking all of the non-highlights and you're probably not celebrating the little things that are happening. So don't compare someone else's highlights to your shadow. Instead, allow yourself to celebrate the small things. See the small steps that you are taking and know that you are exactly where you're supposed to be and you are on your way to being and creating what it is that you desire. Just because it doesn't happen overnight doesn't mean it's not gonna ever happen. Maybe it won't happen in the timeline that you expected to, but again, it doesn't mean that it won't be created. There are lessons to learn in this life. That is what you need to remember. So a big reason why I work with life coaches, I have my own life coaches and business coaches, is because I want to understand and know my lessons of life. I don't want to be with them these one lesson or two lessons for years and years. For me, if there's a lesson I'm learning, I'm learning, I want to get to the bottom of it. I want to see the root of it. And I want to be able to move through it. I don't want to get stuck in my life just as much as I know you don't want to get you stuck in your life. This is where life coaching comes in. Life coaches help you find a new perspective so that you can learn the life lessons that are here for you. So you can see the meaning of the experiences that you're having rather than chasing after this feeling of happiness that really doesn't last very long. Meaning will be with you forever. Happiness, it's fleeting. So if you'd like to learn a little bit more about working with me as a life coach and my amazing uh, community of highly sensation seeking, highly sensitive people, I invite you to apply for the program, the mentoring program. I will leave a link with this video so that you can see if this group will be a match for you. This group is for what I call people who are bridges, people who have a connection to the spiritual world and people who have a connection to the physical, real, reality, grounded world that we see and live in in each day. So if you think you might be a bridge, someone who's connected to the spiritual side and also has a physical connection to earth, and making sure that you are thriving and enjoying your life here on earth, then you're someone who I recommend to apply to the Synchronize Your Life mentoring program. Okay, again, that link will be connected to this video. And if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, I look forward to receiving your application. All right, have a great rest of your day. Take care. Bye-bye.